Hey yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Marky Ace over here. Back with another video. Now, I know it's been a minute since uh, I posted a video on my YouTube. Alright, so today I'm gonna do a little video here. You know, it's a nice day outside, you know. I'm chilling in my backyard right now. So uh yeah. So in this video, I'm just gonna do a little uh, video where I chat with you guys about, you know, just just recent shit, you know, recent events going on in the world, maybe the internet or locally. All right. So, uh, so I'm gonna get to some topics here. Now, as a guy who makes YouTube videos and in the in this industry. I gotta talk about these recent issues, all right? So that they've been making headlines on the internet. So uh, yeah, let's go on about it, all right? So first up, let's talk about uh, James Charles here, all right? You guys know who James Charles is, you know, makeup vlogger, you know, all that, you know. So recently he's been in some drama with his uh his a uh, friend or should I say former best friend Toddy Westbrook all right you know she made a video about all about him exposing him and shit you know but like after watching that I'm like you know I kind of feel bad for him you know on like one side because like what the hell like what the hell Toddy like how could you expose him like that? Like, that's like, you know, you're going above the law there, you know? Like, make a video talking shit about him, exposing all the secrets, man. That's like, like, James, you should sue for that. That's, she, she just, she crossed the line there doing that to you, man. Man, like, you don't deserve that, you know? That's, that's bad, you know? Like, bad shit like she shouldn't be doing that man it's, you know but but then I was watching the video and then I heard I heard some she was saying something about like uh, Charles James Charles trying to turn straight men gay and I'm like what what the hell that's a that's what that what in the world James like that almost seems impossible, but I don't know if he really tried to do it or not. But, but hey, you know that's what it is. But yeah, moving on, on to, on to the next issue going on that was going on on the internet. All right, we got Tifu. All right, gamer Tifu was suing Phase Clan. All right, so so as you know, last April Tifu joined Phase Clan and all that yada yada yada. All right, so apparently Tifu is suing Phase Clan now over this oppressive contract. Right, apparently Phase Clan is taking eight percent of his earnings. This is bullshit. Which he made like. You know, during his Twitch streams, whatever. All right. But like, you know, watching the video, sorry, watching, looking at the story, you know, it seems that, you know, FaZe Clan offered Tifu this contract and he saw everything that was wrong with the contract, all right? And, like, dude, he signed it, alright? He signed the contract. Now, I kind of think, like, what? Like, Tifu, you're an idiot. Like, you know, like, you saw the contract. You saw that something was wrong with it, alright? And you still signed it. Like, what? Come on, dude, and like, 
makes you feel bad because like you know Faceland, like you know Faze Banks, he, they really you know stood for you. you know, they really liked you. You know, you were like you're like a hype, a super hype gamer right now. All right, and you're all right, and they offered you like different contracts. If you didn't like that contract, you know, like they had other contracts for you. So, like, why did you sign that contract? Like the current contract you have right now. And now you're doing all this, you're putting up all this bullshit on them, doing them, and all that, like. Like, dude, the joke's on you, dude. All right? And, you know. In this whole situation, the one person, the one person that I really feel bad for is Tifu's girlfriend, Corinna Cop, all right? Now, because, now, I feel bad because she was just, she was just randomly dragged in the middle of this whole thing, you know? Because she's dating him, she was li literally just dragged into it, all right? Saying she was... Like, they're all saying that, you, know, you know, like, people are saying, you know, she started dating him, she, she came to the clout, to the house, to the clout house a lot, you know, or the face house, whatever. Came there, you know, started, because she was dating Tifu, and then, you know, all of a sudden she stopped coming there. You know, they all called out Karenna on it, you know, saying, you know, she caused this whole thing. She like she caused Tifu to do all this and get mad at Face Clan and leave them and do all this shit to them. So me, I just I just honestly feel bad for her. You know, like I just feel bad that like this happened and she just happened to be in the middle of the whole thing. You know. Yeah, but so uh, back on to uh, Tifu. Like, dude, man, you are you are really an idiot, man. All right? Like, I'm just like, if I saw that contract, if I were you, Tifu, and I saw the contract, either one, I would have not signed it. I would have not joined Face Clan, or I would have asked them for like different contracts or like like different offerings. You know, like I wouldn't just I wouldn't like sign a contract and then sue them for my own mistake. All right, like this whole thing is on you, man. All right, the joke's on you. Right? Like, I don't know why you really did this. Face Clan. To, to Face Clan, man. Like. Like. They vouched for you, man. Face Clan, like, they. They had a heart for you. They, they wanted you in their team. And this is what you do to them, man? What the. What the hell, man? The hell, bro? Like. Shit's insane, man. Right? Like, I really don't know what to say about this issue. And then, then I'm gonna talk about right now the, the whole thing about the alcohol, drugs, and sorry, just the alcohol and underage gambling. That also like. No, I watched the videos about the whole thing. I watched Faze Bank's video about Tifu and like even the drinking and gambling. The underage drinking and gambling is all on him, man. Like he's the one that did it. So I don't know why you gotta bring that up. But yo, let, let's take a look at that that released the contract video Tifu made about. This is about me and this contract. This contract that I signed when 
I didn't know any better. I'm an idiot. I should have never signed it in the first place. This three-year contract. What is in this contract is so bizarre. It's so fucked. I wish you guys could see this thing because I can't even fathom it. This contract basically allows FaZe at any point in the three years to just fucking take all my hard earnings and all my hard work and just strip it over 49 percent over 79 percent these what is in this contract is insane and that's not even the worst parts these contracts are not okay and this needs to never happen again and there's tons of people in contracts this bad just like me and i'm the first person to stand up and say this is fucked this is not right this is not cool this is fucking bullshit this is fucking bullshit and if only you guys could see what is in this contract i can't disclose what is within this contract but phase clan please release the contract for the public to see fuck let me show the public just give me permission to show these people the truth the truth that is within this contract that's all i really have to say show the fucking contract phase release the fucking contract everybody hashtag release the fucking contract release it please come on come on do it do it Come on, I'm come here. on. Come on, do it now! Yo, that video is actually funny. Like, I could watch that all day. <laughs> he was like, release the contract. Release the contract. But yeah, but moving on. Moving on to uh, the issue with uh, KSI and Deji. All right. Now, you know them. Oh, look at that rabbit, bro. It's a rabbit. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, hey, man. Yo, what up, buddy? Yo, yo, bitch, where you going? I want to talk to you. Let me talk to you, bro. Nope. Alright. Yo, that, that bitch Rob didn't want to talk to me, man. I just, want, I just wanted to holler at her, but, like, she walked away. I don't know what's wrong with me today, man. Yeah, so back onto the issue. So, KSI and, uh, Deji, right, two brothers, they've been going at it for like, like, months and months now, like, this dude, they, they've been having, right, and they've been making video after video at one another, you know, like, Deji made, recently made a video at him, and then KSI made a, made a video, man, like, like, you two are, brother, are brothers, man, I think the problem with you two need to be resolved. Like, I mean, it seriously needs to be resolved. Like, I don't know, whatever you two are doing, just settle it. It may be a boxing match, man. Yo, KSI Deji, KSI Deji boxing match, 2019, live, man. I'll watch it, you know. Like, the shit between you two, from what I'm hearing, it's, it's getting crazy, man. Like, like, I can imagine, like, if me and and my one of my brothers had an issue like that, like our family would be torn apart. But good thing we're not having that issue. Like literally, crazy shit going on in the world. Oh yeah, and. Uh, on to the next one. Now, this is not a recent internet issue, but since, uh, you know, y'all know your boy's from Toronto, and I gotta give love for my Raptors, man. You know, we won Raptors in the end, our first NBA Finals. You know, we won game one last week. We lost game two, but we won game three last night, you know. We, we got more, sorry, we, we are beating the Golden State Warriors right now. I don't want, I, don't, I really don't want to shove it in Golden State's face right now, but yo, we on a roll. Sorry, Warriors. Sorry, Steph Curry, but it's like, I guess we got the mojo this year and y'all don't. 
you know, I feel like I should just, I should go to Golden State Territory as a Raptors fan and just sh shove it and all the Golden State fans be like, yo, Golden State sucks. They trash, bro. We Raptors, we, have, we got their number. Like, I kind of actually want to do that now, you know? But yeah, guys, uh, let me know who you're rooting for, you know, if, it, if you're rooting Golden State or Warriors, or Warriors, you know? Sir. But yeah, guys, let me know if you're rooting for Golden State or the Raptors. I know all y'all watching were from Toronto or Raptors, so we good. But anybody else, you know, who's from neither cities, let me know in the comments. All right, who you're rooting for, you trash talk whatever team you want. All right, give your honest opinions about any of the two teams. All right, I'm from Toronto, so I'm a Raptors fan. I, I root for my Raptors. You know, our first NBA Finals. All right, we got this on lock. All right. And uh, also comment down below your opinions about every talk, every topic that I've just talked about in this video. All right? Comment if you if you follow a lot of YouTube stuff, you watch a lot of YouTube internet stuff, and you follow all the, the issues, the news, the drama going on. Let me know your opinions or your. Or if you don't give a shit, you know, just whatever. You know, just be like, you know, I don't give a shit about it, or I'm interested in this news. But yeah, just let, just comment your what you think of these issues, these dramas down below. You know, you know, YouTube, you know, the YouTube world, you know, people, the people, you know, they out of hand. But it is what it is. Okay. So. Yeah, it's a nice day, you know, it's a nice sunny day, I'm off work, you know, I'm just, you know, your boy's just chilling in his backyard, you know, making this video, alright, so, uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for today's video, uh, I don't know when I'll be back with a new video, but, uh, I'm gonna let you guys know this, uh, I am going to Europe, in a few weeks all right so maybe my next video will be a little adventure vlog you know two-part adventure vlogs coming up soon all right and uh yeah so as you know i'm a barber all right the shop i work at is icon fade all right you can book with me online at iconfade.com you're looking for a, if you're looking for a barber all right and if you're in the Toronto area you know you know where to find me my name is Mark on Icon Fade all right and uh, so that's gonna do it for today's video and uh, I hope you guys have a good day and take care you know Ace Force where you at and uh, yeah, that's it. All right. all right, you guys all go love yourselves. All right, it's your boy Mark Yates signing out. Peace.